All right, you guys, a lot's happened since the last time I posted. And I always say I'm gonna keep posting consistently, and I never do, but maybe one day I will. I've now reached 1,500 sales with my company July Body on Shopify. I think I'm at like 80 sales on Amazon. But that's beside the point, 1,500 sales, super, super happy with that. And I hit over 1,000 followers on Instagram. I think I'm all the way up to like 1,100 now, so. Moral of the story, we're growing guys. And I also am running super low on inventory. I think I have like, maybe like 400 units left. The last restock I had, I bought 3,500 units. And so this is gonna be the second time this year I've sold out. And the time before that I had 2,000 units, which I got in like last October, sold out at the beginning of the year. Got 3,500 in like mid February, sold that out in like three months. And then the next time I order some, I'm probably gonna order like six or 7,000. Probably gonna have to find a warehouse, so I'm gonna try to take you guys along. Cause since I'm running low on inventory, and it's probably gonna be two months before I get my next shipment in, I thought I might pick up the camera and film some stuff. But since I'm running low, I cut my marketing budget to zero. So now I'm just getting like a few sales a day. Typically I'll get like five or six sales without marketing anything. So I don't know how people find my site, but I mean, I guess it's a good thing, right? And uh, yesterday I had the most sales without spending a dollar on marketing. I had 11 sales, which I don't know how people found my site. There was like 190 people on my website yesterday. So that's cool, 11 sales, I'll take that. And uh, yeah, right now, so with my manufacturer, so when my shipment was coming over, um, overseas, I had some issues, like some of the powder coat was like started coming off because some of the units would like bang into each other. So right now I'm going through all of the units that I have left and like over the course of when I was making units, some of the ones that were like a lot of the material taken off, I kind of put aside. So now I'm like organizing all the different ones from like if there's a small chip on it or if it's a bigger one, stuff I can't use. I'm saying to my manufacturer to get like a credit towards them to even it out. So I'm organizing that right now and it's a pain in the ass. Um, I have so many units laying out right now. It's not looking too good. When it comes to organizing, I can clearly say I'm not good at it. And I do not like to do it, which is an issue right now, but I'm getting better with it by doing this. Not, not necessarily. Um, yeah, it's just a pain. It's a huge mess. So this is what's looking like. What a, what a mess. But these are all the ones that have like, have slight issues with them. That small little nick. So they're still sellable and they'll still work, which is good. But then some of these other ones over here, like as you can see, this thing just completely fell off. Some of these other ones, ones that just have ones where I don't, I'm not really gonna sell because it's too much and I want my product out there looking like this. This will pile because the holes on these aren't completely centered. So when I try to put two units together, they won't open up and they don't aligned to make it so I can put a screw in them. So I can't use these ones either, but I still have, I'll actually show you guys it over here. Still have all these boxes. These are like the ones that when I was assembling some units, they came out not looking good. So I set them aside for this moment. Yeah, it's, it's a pain in the ass but I got to knock it out. All right, so I just went to the doctor. I had an appointment for my hips because I've been, you know, having some hip pain, honestly, like the past couple of years. So that's why I haven't been able to do much like lower body movements or even just like run or bike, really anything. Cause it's like moved onto my knee and my ankle. But I went to the doctor and he told me, sir, your hips don't lie. I said, damn right. Um, no, he told me I probably have like some structural <laughs> damage. So I have to get an MRI. I hope I don't have to get surgery again. Haven't had my hips yet, but I've had them both my shoulders. So I guess time will tell with that. <laughs> Not at all what I was hoping or expecting, but yeah, that's, a, that's an update with that, I guess. Look at this. All laid out and everything. It took me so long to do that and I'm exhausted. Cause I even put them in piles of 10, which um, just to make it so I can count them easy. But I'm gonna say it for like 30 more minutes, send my manufacturer some pictures, and then I'm going to bed, guys. I'm gonna do some filming tomorrow of what you guys have as grave a guess as I do, cause I have no idea. All right, you guys, it is the next morning and my manufacturer reached back out to me at like three in the morning Obviously I was sleeping, so I saw their message today and they told me I had like a week or two once I got the units to like file a claim to get like some money back on some of the damaged units, which totally makes sense. So 
some of the really damaged ones, I'm either just gonna put on sale on my website or I'm just gonna like throw them away. So really separating them, <laughs> doing all this stuff, was kind of a waste of time. But uh, my basement right now is an absolute mess, which this is my, my work area. But this is what everything's looking like right now. But it's all gonna be cleaned up by the end of the day. Just fulfilling some orders right now. I got 25 other orders to, to fulfill. Can't even speak. I couldn't really put any units together yesterday because I was waiting for my manufacturer to respond to see what kind of like videos and pictures they needed to actually um, like get the claim start so I could get some money back. Because a lot of these units I can I can still use. It's a very small like scratch or chip, so it's not a big deal. But um, I couldn't really put any together, so I only have like 22 units put together. After yesterday's orders, I probably need like a hundred. But I'll be able to do that all today while I'm cleaning this up. So yeah, that's an update. What's the next clip gonna be? I'm probably gonna show you guys an update on my dog, Jax. My boy, my king. Yeah, so that'll be here soon. Here he is in the flesh. Hey Jax, come here. <laughs> Hey boy. Say it. Good boy. Look how proper this pup is. He's got, he's like 35 pounds now. When I got him, he was nine. All right, you guys, I just got a new package in. I'm excited for this, all right? I got, I bought a few hats, all right? You know why I bought this? So for the business, of course, because as Mark Zuckerberg once said, you can only run a business if you look good. Did he really say that? Maybe he did, but I'm not gonna go on record for saying that. Here we go, it's from, I think it's Howler Bros. Howler Brothers. But, bang, all right, yeah, these look nice. I got four hats. We got one, two, three, and four. Three of them, so like the yellow, the green, and the black one are all like this um, like full mesh material, which I like, really breathable. And they have a build I'm gonna bend a little bit more, but super happy about these. You gotta look good to run a business. That's the number one business law. Have to look good running a business. So, you know I had to go off. I spent like $140, guys, but I mean, I'm excited. Um, yeah, that's a segment for that. All right, you guys, it's the next day. I'm trying to do this quick because my battery's at 1%, but have the whole basement cleaned up and I have to fulfill, I think it's 34 orders. Got all the pictures taken I need to take for my manufacturer and I gotta fill all these orders. And this area is cleaner as well, so. Yeah, that's where we're at. Also, these are all of the units that are going out today. I just need to put a band in them and then they're all set. All right guys, finally just finished up packing up those orders. We got them all right here. Took me, it is five o'clock right now. I start probably around like, I don't know, like nine, nine or 10. But yeah, I gotta run to the post office because they close in like 30 minutes. And that's the video. Like and subscribe and stay tuned for next week. Peace.